here's a little anniversary shopping blog and I think we're at TJ Maxx here or no we're at Marshall's and there's always so many Patricia Nash bags at my TJ Maxx, Marshall's, even at Ross I believe, maybe not Ross, but that one's a pretty pink clutch. And they always have plenty of Michael Kors. And this one's just a little dome crossbody for $100. I didn't end up buying anything, but man, I was tempted by a few. But look at this Michael Kors. It almost looks like a Louis Vuitton on the go tote. And with the giant MKs. Definitely not quiet luxury or contemporary it's hundred and sixty dollars it's really a big size and it had a nylon strap and then the top handles just really big <laughs> no feet on the bottom Next up is a Kipling, and I have this exact same one, except in a jaded green, but they've upped the price. I paid $39.99, now they're $49.99. I just thought this little bucket from Steve Madden was cute, and a light green. It's really cute. Another Kipling bag, and it was called the black tonal for fifty dollars again the prices have gone up at least ten dollars on these kiplings even in marshall's and tj maxx and there's another the backpack i thought this was cute it's an aldo bag and it reminds me of the coach shine collection but thirty dollars for a cute little going out bag now that is more reasonable than those coach shine bags to me especially when you get fingerprints all over them and but that isn't that cute <laughs> then we have a juicy couture backpack with the fake shirling which is really pretty i i really like this one it had a front pocket super cute backpack on to this coach I'm guessing the medium zip wallet this one was really nice for $60 I contemplated on that one <laughs> this next tote is a Kate Spade bag just a black tote next is a coach bag I found a couple I believe this was the Shea and it's the black pebble leather and, I, and it has the two straps detachable. It's really nice size. Feet on the bottom. Another coach bag. This one was at Ross. I think it said $120. Nice tote. And a, like a cranberry color. With light pink interior. Another Michael Kors tote. And then onto this cutie. I was very, very tempted by this one. <laughs> $30 Steve Madden. It reminds you of the Prada re-edition <laughs> or the sparkly. Very cute and love that color. Probably should have grabbed it. <laughs> then we're on to probably more Patricia Nash. Nope. Just a little browsing here. DKNY. Steve Madden, which you can always find Steve Madden at. There's a Michael Kors. This is a cute tiny backpack. It's called the Love Bug. I had never seen this in person before. And it's the same color backpack I already have, but yeah, the name's Love Bug. It's a cute little backpack with a lot of pockets. And then that one is a much bigger in the same color. I 
And I want to call it a Sewell backpack. Sorry, it's a little jostling. <laughs> I like this fringe bag. It was cute. Again, another clutch by Patricia Nash. With all the colors. This was really pretty. But I don't need a clutch. <laughs> no strap. Then this Patricia Nash wallet surprised me. Because it opens up all the way. Instead of, they used to just open a little ways, now it's all the way open. I like that kind of billfold wallet. Really pretty red color. Another Patricia Nash. <laughs> it's a pretty green. And then they also have it in this blue. Another Juicy Couture, you know, those aren't real leather, but it's still cute. This little guest purse reminded me of Prada, a little re-edition bag for $40. And this one was a uh, made in Italy leather hobo style bag. And this one was a Steve Madden that reminded you of a city bag from Balenciaga. Balenciaga. <laughs> and just browsing, that looks like that new coach one that's coming out. Another Patricia Nash, of course. If you're ever in my town, if you go to TJ Maxx or Marshalls, you will always find Patricia Nash. <laughs> no matter when I go to the these shops, I will always find them. And again, a uh, green Patricia Nash. Little Sherlene crossbody bag. You guessed it, another one. Another Patricia Nash. $60. I've never bought a Patricia Nash. This was our anniversary, so we went shopping and went to dinner. And I did not buy anything from any of these places we went to. Another Patricia Nash. <laughs> I just like this soft, furry, juicy couture bag. <laughs> Tote bag. But that is the end of the vlog. And thank you for watching. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.